Hello YouTube. The latest addition now to my Husqvarna T250. As you know I fitted the recluse clutch. Today we are going to fit the recluse left hand braking system. And just to give you a quick little look what's in the box. There's some flyover with all the bits. I don't know if you can see in there. But you've got a syringe, a bleed nipple and bits and bobs. Now, what I basically did, I did go online and watch a quick video how they do it, just to have a rough knowledge how to fit it. Now, most importantly it is, I got it ready, so obviously it's not that important. So I'm going to open the tool kit up, and we're going to get cracking. Way to start. Turn the fuel off. Pretty important. Phone call coming in. Okay, I think what we're going to do is take the seat off. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Now this is for my my headlight. So it'll be nice and out by bar running down through there. And there. So I'll do this job pretty quick. Positive and negative straight off the battery. I put an inline fusing, uh, which is a spade clip, and I've run the wire now probably properly through underneath the tank up into my light switch, which then operates my super duper bream. Now, the benefits of doing that when the bike cuts out, the light doesn't, so pretty important. And I'm glad I've done it. So now I just want some insulation tape. So basically what they're saying is slacken it off the clutch lever. So
Okay, so that's the fitting. Okay, so that's the finished product. Sorry I couldn't really speak you through it because it took a little bit longer than I expected. But that's only right in the cable and anything else. Pretty simple. Once you've got to the desired length, you just clip it off 
and then you put the, the, the bit on, it's self-explanatory, you can't go wrong, you push it in and then you adjust it to where you want it and to be honest it was perfect, I just give it a little test, it's locking the back rake up practically straight away um, next thing to do is a test right I've gone back down to a 13 sprocket, I found the 14 was just not enough oomph in second for me type style um, I like second gear to be a good wallop in it uh, with the recluse, the 13 seems to be the perfect option I haven't altered the power band at all um, cause apparently you can just adjust this and it'll come in earlier or later um, most of them wind it out and then they go in half a turn but I'm satisfied with that so I'm gonna leave it and just try it out watch this space <laughs> 